When we print the project schedule from MS project with default settings, you see that the information of bar chart is coming on multiple pages and although there are not so much activities but if we see uh, we get the blank pages so many blank pages and uh, thick end chart is split on multiple pages and i think it is not a professional way to print out like this so today we will see how to print out uh, with more good settings and it will look uh, more professional so let's jump into ms project and do the settings here i have sample project and i will try to print out this so if i print with the default settings you will see here it is uh, printing out on four pages and if, if i see more information you will see here that uh, either on some pages uh, the, uh, the task activities list are not present and on some the bars are not present so i think this is not uh, the good uh, schedule print and now i will print out with the setting so first uh, with the very first setting i will change into time scale and i will try to compress our uh, uh, shrink it so that I sh uh, I get a whole gain chart uh, correctly so uh, normally with the default settings we see here the two tiers uh, middle uh, tier and the bottom tier but we can change into three tiers top middle and bottom and we can put on the top uh, years information and uh, then accordingly with the lowest levels so uh, I will change the middle tier into months and now on the bottom tier I will change from days to weeks and you will see that you can also change the labels uh, how will your weeks or your the months will look like so I will change this into this and you can ch uh, it is your choice to show this non-working time either you want to show or down draw so let's keep other settings as it is and you will see the our information is shrink so now drag it up to here and now we will try to print our schedule so go here and print this now you will see that our schedule is coming up on just two pages and it has the page numbers has been reduced and we are not noticing any blank page or any page with the scattered information so on this print we will see uh, these are the legends and it you can change it from the page setup from the legend and it is your choice to show our, our uh, none are the legend page separately and we are so many options here as well we can change the margins if i will change the margins these outlines uh, will not draw so you can change uh, the headers from and you can put information of your company your scheduler or just uh, the information you need it so i will put here for example any uh, project uh, company for example and you uh, for example this text and bold it should be bold and let's keep the other settings so this is the preview and click ok now i will put for example abc for example so all other settings you can do you can reduce the margin size as well and uh, uh, let's see now you will see that the the text we entered is coming up here and the other setting is uh, go to page setup and uh, we are seeing only up to finish table means a column so we will change uh, view from the view settings and we will print out all the 
columns we have so now you can see that we are getting more information and uh, it is over your choice how many columns you want to print out you can also print out the very first three columns or four columns are just the information you needed so let's print the very first four pages a uh, column so now it is okay i think now this was a little bit detailed uh, setting now we, uh, we you can also print out uh, with a single click now i am changing back into detail uh, the information now i am going to here print out again and now i will go to here page setup and from the page i will change to fix to one page only and you will see when i will click ok i will get only one page this is the page you can see uh, and you can change the page size from letter to whatever required a3 and you will see and from the dates you can change the starting dates as well and uh, you can also change uh, how the specific dates pages as well so with the, with, there are a lot more options you can just uh, but i think this is the more professional and the good with good settings print out you see here uh, i uh, it is uh, coming on one pages one page as well and earlier it was coming up on two pages and we can also change that uh, the two pages uh, from here adjust to here so that is also the setting you can also uh, play with the options so this is the print and exactly when you will save the file in as a pdf you will get exactly the same way it is showing up so this was the video I hope you will uh, like it and it is informative for you.